YouTube channel. My name is Noah and you're watching Noah Constrictor. Ooh, spooky Noah Constrictor. So as you guys are aware, it is almost Halloween. And if you can't tell, Halloween is probably my favorite holiday. The spook, the costumes, the candy, I just love all of it. So I thought, why not do something else I love? Answering questions. So this is a Halloween and fall Q&A with tea in a spooky mug. So, I asked you guys questions over on my Instagram and you sent in a lot this time. So if I don't get around to all of your questions, I'm sorry, but if you wanna leave some in the comments, I can just type out my answer if you're that curious. And yeah, so let's begin the Halloween Q&A. Okay, so question number one is, what's your favorite Halloween song? Now there are really only like three classic picks. You have Monster Mash, Ghostbusters, and Spooky Scary Skeletons. But there is this one that I love called, I think it's called Haunted House by Gene Simmons, but not the guy from Kiss. It's a different guy with the same name, but it's not the Kiss one. But I like that one, but other than that, probably Monster Mash. Purely just because there's like such a small variety of them. Question number two, have you slash do you want to go to a haunted house? So I have never been in a haunted house and I really want to. I also get scared very easily and I'm kind of worried that I'd have like nightmares for years, you know, but I do kind of want to go into one and I guess it depends on how big it is and how like terrifying it would be. I think if I was like there with a friend or something like it could be a lot better. Yeah, so no, I have not been in one. But the answer is yes, but also no. The answer is yes, but the answer is also no. So which the answer you're looking for is yes, but also no. So... Okay, the next question. What's your favorite candy? And a lot of people ask this one. My favorite candy off the top of my head is Reese's or Kit Kat or Snickers or Skittles. Twix, or Crunch, or Fun Dip, or Jolly Ranchers. I guess I have lots of favorite candies, but my favorite off of the top of my head would just be Reese's or Kit Kat. You can't go wrong with those. And another question kind of included in that one is, and your least favorite candy. I don't think I have like a least favorite name brand candy, but I don't really like caramel. Question four, do you still go trick-or-treating? You betcha I do. Am I probably getting too old for it? Yes. Do I still want to do it? Yes. This year I probably won't just to be safe because of the like pandemic, you know. But if there wasn't that going on, I probably 100% would. Yeah, I love trick-or-treating, so I would gladly still trick-or-treat. Okay. The next question, favorite Halloween movie? Now, I've really only ever seen like four. There's not a lot of variety. So I guess my top pick is probably Coraline, which by the way, a jar of buttons from a thrift store so that I could become like the other Noah, you know? Wow, it's me, the other Noah. So creepy. Huh. So yeah, my favorite Halloween movie? Probably Coraline. Really good. Would recommend, but it's really scary for a lot of people, so... 
Maybe I do have a higher scare tolerance than I thought I did. Who knows? Next question. What was your first Halloween costume? <laughs> if I'm remembering correctly, my first Halloween costume, I was a... Drumroll. Peapod. Yup. My first Halloween costume was a peapod. Just saying, as far as peapods come, I was a pretty cute one. I'm not gonna lie, I was a cute peapod. <laughs> but yup, that was my first Halloween costume. The next question is, what is your favorite fall activity? My favorite fall activity is probably Halloween. I mean, like, let's be honest, I love Halloween, like, duh. But if I had to pick something other than that, it would probably be, like, spending time with family. And I know that that sounds like I'm lying, and typically an answer like that would be lying. But honestly, like, I love it. My family has, like, we have, like, a fa farm in our family that we go to. And I actually did a vlog when I was, like, kind of there. And it's just really fun to be there, and it's pretty, and the colors are so bright. So honestly, my favorite fall activity is probably like going out to that farm, which we do a lot, luckily, and it's, it's cool. Next question, the classic, what are you being for Halloween? Well, I'm being Aang from Avatar The Last Airbender. I love Aang so much and like, I had to be him for Halloween, you know? Like, Avatar has just completely, like, taken over my life. And it would just be a crime to go as anything other than him, so. The costume is just right over here. Here's the staff. Pretty cool, you know? But yeah, I'm Aang for Halloween. Which is a pretty obvious choice for me, I think. Favorite Halloween monster slash villain. <laughs> Most of the Halloween, like, villains or whatever are monsters, and even if they're not villains, they're, like, creepy. Now, I don't know if this counts, but Scooby-Doo is kind of Halloween-y, and my favorite one is the Phantom, or Phantom Shadow, which not only is on my Scooby-Doo Converse, but also I have the action figure to it right here. So this is, like, by far my favorite Halloween creature, monster. But other than that, my favorite Halloween creature is probably the other mother, just because, like, she was pretty cool and kind of reminded me of Mother Gothel, but even more insane. So yeah, that or just Dracula, because, like, Dracula's cool, you know? But yeah, so Phantom and Phantom Shadow, like, over there. The other mother or Dracula. Those are the faves. What is your craziest Halloween costume? My craziest Halloween costume, hands down, has to be as when I went as a Rubik's Cube. Yeah, you heard me right. I went as a Rubik's Cube. Mm-hmm, like one of these things. I went as a Rubik's Cube. But yeah, I made it because my mom and my aunt went as them when they were kids. And I thought like, hey, that's a pretty clever idea. But theirs were like all made. And since there's no way I could ever actually solve a Rubik's Cube, I'll go as a mismatched Rubik's Cube. So I did that two years ago and it was... Definitely the craziest one I've done. Okay, the next question is scariest Halloween experience. I don't really get scary Halloween experiences because if you've seen in my last video, my family's decor is like along the lines of a preschool classroom, essentially. Mine goes for a bit darker. Like, I mean, dead roses and a skull. My family wouldn't want that out. They wouldn't want this. Editor's note, that's so stupid because who doesn't want skulls all over their house? I mean, come on, people. All right, oh boy, on to the final question. What's your most favorite Halloween costume? I'm torn because I've gone as a lot of really great things throughout the years. I mean, like, being a Peapod before I turned one, it's like, that's, like, pretty cool, you know? But in 2012, I went as Harry Potter, which was pretty cute. And I won this best book character costume. I know, my costume's pretty great. I also loved going as the Rubik's Cube. Like, that might be my favorite. But also, I liked going as a Harry Potter character last year again. Because, like, that was just cool. And I did it with my friend Avery, who this year we're going as Aang and Sokka. And that might be my favorite just because Avatar is, like, my favorite thing. But I've had a lot of good ones. And I really don't think I can pick a favorite for this one. Okay, 
So that is gonna wrap it up for today's Halloween and fall themed Q&A. If you enjoyed, make sure to give this video a like, comment anything that you want down below about Halloween, maybe tell you where you're gonna be, because I love getting comments. And subscribe if you are new. Love you, bye!